there guys, Billabo10000 here, bringing you another bit of news for Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. Well, it's more of a code leak that I thought was really interesting and I wanted to share with you guys. So yesterday, a leak appeared on 4chan and it looks like a code that looks like it's been drawn on an etcher sketch and nobody really understood what it meant. So it got shared on Smashboards and everyone's been looking at this line art, for better term, trying to figure out exactly what it means. And then a user by the name of Levy22 managed to crack the code. Uh, in their own words, I tried measuring distances between lines and all sorts of things, but the only one code that made sense was that the forms moved in only two directions. Since it said code, I thought it might be binary. Only two things to worry about, two zeros and ones. So I started searching for a pattern in the first big code, and they discovered that if the code turned left, you would get a zero, if it turned right, you would get a one, and they managed to find the name Simon in one of the pictures. Now the official fully leaked picture will be shown on screen, uh, but shout out to Levy22 for solving this. Uh, firstly, we have Inkelge, which is Inkling. Uh, then we've got Ridley, which is Ridley. We've got Wadi, which means Waddle D. We've got Juniper, which is uh, the Japanese equivalent of Decidueye. K. Rule, Isaac, heck yeah. Ashley, without the E, Simon, Rayman, and DLC BK, which has been taken to mean DLC Banjo Kazooie, or DLC is back. We don't know which one it means, but this is such an interesting leak. I thought it was a really, well, not a leak, it's more of a rumor, but it was more of, it was such an interesting way to sort of present a little puzzle, and it just shows how the community really gets behind and solves these things so quickly. Uh, so shout out to Levy22 for solving this uh, th this uh, rumor, and hopefully you guys uh, find it interesting. To be honest, if these were all of our newcomers, I'd be pretty happy with that. I mean, Isaac's in there, so I'm I'm already set. This sounds pretty goddamn cool. Uh, although I'm pretty sure it's fake because DLC uh, Banjo Kazooie wouldn't make sense because. Uh, Sakurai usually doesn't plan DLC until after uh, the development of the main game is created, uh, but DLC is back. If that's what it means, then that could possibly be feasible. So, uh, while this probably isn't our final roster, I think it's a pretty interesting thing regardless, and I found it pretty interesting. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you enjoyed, feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you on Monday for the next Rate Their Chances. Thank you so much for watching, and... Goodbye. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I want to give a quick shout out to my Patreons. You can find their names down below. You guys keep me going each and every month. Thank you so much for your support. If you guys enjoyed, make sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you next time. Goodbye.